the, the trial has uh, most definitely showed us that uh, the vaccine can prevent this UK variant as well as the previous uh, strains that were circulating. So this is really good news. So it's it, in many ways a traditional uh, vaccine technology. Um, but uh, in this case, uh, Novavax uh, do this in a way that it requires extremely small uh, doses of the, the spike protein. And that means they have enormous capacity to scale up and produce the, well, or no, enormous numbers of doses that are really required to vaccinate the world, uh, which, is, which is now what we want. The South, Afri uh, South African phase two study that's been done with this vaccine, which uh, has shown it is effective against the South African variant as well, is really good news. Now, not quite as effective as, as, as it is against the UK variant, uh, and it may therefore mean that uh, modifying the spike protein or indeed adding a separate um, uh, component to the vaccine uh, will now be considered, and Novavax are now doing that, and that may be the, the answer to, to deal completely with, the, for example, the South African variant. Uh, I think the, the, the beauty of the technology is it can be, it can be adapted quickly uh, to uh, change, to include these new variants, should that be necessary. And that means we can keep ahead of this virus. And the other aspect of this technology that's wonderful is that the extremely small amounts of the uh, protein are necessary uh, for the vaccine. Uh, and as we've, she as we've seen, that means it, even so, the, the vaccine is extremely effective. But that means the capacity to make large uh, volumes of this vaccine is there. And that's, after all, what we need uh, when we are going to need to vaccinate the world. The, the nature of the technology is such that it can be made um, very widely. And indeed, uh, Novavax are, uh, have a number of uh, va uh, vaccine manufacturing um, uh, hubs uh, uh, in different places in the world. So yes, this is, it, this is something that is flexible and, and it can be manufactured at pace in, in different parts of the world. Well, I think that we now have another uh, COVID-19 vaccine that is safe and highly effective. That's number one. Number two, it's highly effective against the new variant. So that takes away perhaps some of the doubt that we may have had uh, as to whether this variant was going to be a, uh, an important barrier to uh, having an effective vaccine in the UK. But I think we have shown that that is not the case. So uh, I think that's the main um, uh, headline news with this vaccine and this result.